some of our hackers are back at it, and this time they have a political rallying cry, it seems. They've um, left game developers alone, and they are taking aim at entire cities now. And uh, this week, they took aim at the city of Orlando in Florida. According to the New York Times, the hacker group Anonymous, I mean, we've talked a lot about them here, they may or may not have overlapping members with the now defunct hacktivist group Lil Sack, but either way, they took credit for crashing MasterCard and the Church of Scientology's websites. And now, they are going after Orlando, Florida websites. Anonymous has always been a lot more outwardly political than Lulsec. Um, Lulsec seemed to take joy in taunting corporations on their Twitter, and that's how they pass the time. So Anonymous generally has a motive, more so to speak. The attacks on Orlando are an answer to the city's 2006 ordinance that prohibits organizations to feed groups of 25 or more unless they have a permit. Obviously, there couldn't have been some contention unless Orlando acted on this, and Anonymous feels that Orlando police have been targeting the group Orlando Food Not Bombs, a group that provides vegan and vegetarian meals to homeless people in an Orlando city park. This summer, police have arrested 25 Food Not Bombs members who were distributing food without a permit. The city ordinance additionally only allows a group to have two permits per year per park. The straw that broke the camel's back, so to speak, was this past Wednesday when Anonymous offered a ceasefire of hacking if no one was arrested during another feeding of the homeless by Food Not Bombs. However, unfortunately, two group members were arrested and Anonymous took aim. They immediately disrupted a website downtown Orlando, which contains city information and deals with the redevelopment of the city. Um, but city officials aren't backing down on this one. They say they have no plans to change the ordinance. And Anonymous has no plans to halt attacks. Um, they tweeted, for every arrested person, Anonymous will deface or assault 10 websites in Orlando. It's a little, it's a big threat. Um, we will keep you updated on this battle, uh, Orlando versus hacker group Anonymous, and we will definitely let you know if the hackers take a step back and go back to targeting Sony. Hope not.